You have either enrolled in an online course or you are considering it. What will you need to be successful? In this presentation, we'll cover some specific tips to help you be successful in your online courses. First of all, make sure that you have the things that you need. Check out the technical requirements for participation in an online course. Make sure that you will have internet access when you need it. Read the course syllabus entirely so that you're familiar with the software needs, required textbooks, assignments, grading procedures, due dates, and overall expectations for the course. It is your responsibility to read the syllabus thoroughly. Knowing what to expect will help you stay focused and not feel overwhelmed. Spend some time in desire to learn, getting used to where things are located. Then once your classes get underway, you won't need to spend a great deal of time just trying to figure out where things are located, like where to submit assignments or how to check your grades. Time management might be the most critical factor of your online success. With this in mind, you'll want to set a schedule and stick to it. Create a schedule for yourself that allows for three hours per credit for study time. In your calendar, write in your fixed commitments. Then schedule your study time and stick to it. Procrastination can be a big problem for online students. As you are studying, pay attention to how long you can effectively study in one sitting and how long it takes you to complete assignments. Use this information as you schedule your study time. If you have a big project or assignment, set milestones for yourself and put those on your calendar as a way to self-check your progress and avoid starting too late. You can integrate your calendar with the Desire to Learn calendar if you choose. You'll find instructions for doing this within the searchable D2L Help for Students from the Resources menu. Keep a copy of the syllabus handy. Read through it entirely at the beginning of the course and refer back to it often throughout the course. You may even want to print a copy of the syllabus for quick and easy reference. Be sure that you know the expectations for the course and if you have questions, don't hesitate to ask them right away. Once your course begins, log in to D2L daily to check for course announcements, feedback on assignments, and to read and contribute to course discussions. Also, check your campus email daily for any messages or announcements that may require your attention. Checking in regularly will make it easier to keep up. Many of the nonverbal communication methods that instructors use in determining when students are having problems, such as confusion, frustration, boredom, or absence, are not possible in an online class. If you are experiencing difficulty at any level with technology or with the course content, you must communicate this immediately, otherwise your instructor may never know. If you have questions or concerns, contact the instructor. Instructors will list their contact information, including their office hours, in the course syllabus. If they are unable to help you, they can direct you to someone who can. Your online courses may require you to interact and coordinate with others, even though your communication methods may be limited to email, discussion postings, and chat. One of the benefits of an online class is that it gives you the luxury of taking time to compose your thoughts so many students find it less intimidating to voice their opinions or to offer an answer to a question. Not only is participation often required for online courses, you will find that the more you put into it, the more you get out of it. In an online course, you truly cannot afford to get behind. Make sure that you know your deadlines and meet them. Make sure that you back up your work in multiple ways. You can back up to an external disk, a memory stick, another computer, or a cloud-based service. No matter how you choose to do it, just make sure you back up regularly and often. Central Lakes College provides many student support services, including D2L support, access to smartthinking.com tutoring service, and more. Be sure to take advantage of the resources that are available to you. 
A link to the CLC Technology Help Desk is available on the D2L homepage. You can also access searchable help for students from the Resources menu once you are logged in to D2L.